let me tell you why I don't care about total cholesterol and LDL. Did you know that a higher LDL and total cholesterol are linked with longevity? The advice to lower total cholesterol and LDL, bad cholesterol, comes from old falsified studies. New studies show no link over and over again. A high saturated fat intake, high cholesterol, and LDL are not linked with cardiovascular disease or mortality. We've been told to avoid fat because it causes heart disease, while in fact it's sugar, refined carbs, and inflammatory seed oils. If you have high cholesterol or high LDL, look at your diet. Is it raised because of eating natural fats or refined grains and sugar? Refined carbs and sugar increase the harmful type of cholesterol, small harmful LDL particles. Healthy fats like meat, cheese, and eggs increase the harmless LDL cholesterol, fluffy large LDL particles. When you eat ultra-processed foods, seed oils, refined grains, and sugar, you elevate small, harmful LDL particles and triglycerides. Also, you elevate your insulin, which increases inflammation, damages your arteries, and increases your blood pressure. Once you have damage in your arteries, cholesterol comes there to heal the injury. It doesn't cause it. Don't blame the fat for what the carbs did. Refined carbs like bread, pasta, rice, sugar, donuts, sodas, and inflammatory seed oils damage your arteries and your cholesterol. These are the foods that cause cardiovascular disease. Many people with high cholesterol and high LDL are wrongly put on statins. Did you know that statins lower only the harmless cholesterol that doesn't have any effect on heart disease, the fluffy LDL particles? It doesn't lower the real harmful cholesterol that is increased by eating refined carbs. What happens when your doctor puts you on statins to lower cholesterol? People report whole body weakness, pain, and poor memory. Statins are terrible for your brain and hormones. In fact, many studies show no benefit of taking statins. It's just a big business. Also, it blocks coenzyme Q10, which is required for producing energy and protecting the heart. Our brains, cell membranes, and hormones are made of cholesterol. We need cholesterol. Oh, and people who get heart attacks don't actually have high cholesterol. There are studies on that. Also, people with the best survival rates after a heart attack or stroke are the ones with higher cholesterol, not with lower cholesterol. Those with high blood sugar have the lowest survival rates. Cholesterol is the molecule of life. Your body makes high amounts of cholesterol and recycles it because it's that important. If you don't eat enough, your body will make more. If you eat enough, your body will simply make less. Eat your cheese, eggs, fatty meat, and veggies. Avoid processed grains, sugar, seed oils, and ultra-processed fake foods, and you'll be fine. Share this with someone who needs to hear this.